Okay, I'm going to show you, uh, folks, if I take an opportunity to show you what it looks like to probe a large diameter tool. Uh, if this is a five inch, I'm mean, sorry, a five flute, three inch shell mill, and it's got, you know, five carbide inserts in it, and they're all going to be at different heights. So when you probe a tool like this, you need to run it in reverse. And it's going to come down and it's going to rub on that tool probe, and uh, which is, I believe is carbide. I'm not sure. I think it is, though. Let's go ahead and probe this. It's a little scary. Those blinking lights are communicating with the receiver that are mounted up inside the in cor inside corner of the part. I'm mean, inside of the machine, and that's what it uses to send the tool length back to the actual controller. Now, uh, originally this was at 3.969, and if we look at what it came out to be. Now it's saying 3.9693. So it's measuring it within three tenths of what it was stored previously, so I'm happy with that. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and run those three parts and um, we'll see how they come out.